It's Monday, campers. Back at it. With consumers lured by the government's Cash for Clunkers campaign, Ford Motor Company reported its first U.S. sales increase in nearly two years, and about 6,000 GM workers have taken the latest round of early retirement and buyout offers, but it fell short of the company's goal, meaning more layoffs are likely. And while online job advertisements remain steady from June to July, a national report shows over 560,000 fewer advertised vacancies compared with the same period a year earlier. Stocks rose today after data showed the manufacturing sector edged closer to growth in July. Here are the numbers. Google CEO Eric Schmidt is resigning from Apple's board of directors as the internet search leader increasingly develops products that compete with Apple's core businesses. Meanwhile, AIG has chosen former MetLife chief Robert Benmosh as its new CEO, and former Citigroup chief financial officer Sally Krawcheck is joining Bank of America to run the company's global wealth and investment management operation. Speaking of Bank of America, today they agree to pay $33 million to settle charges that it made false and misleading statements to investors about bonuses at Merrill Lynch. For the Business Press, I'm Dave Kaufman. Join us again tomorrow for another Biz Minute.